This episode of Rob's Random Roms is brought to you by Rogue's Apparel, original, custom, hand-printed t-shirts of the highest quality. Shop Rogue's Apparel on Twitter or on Facebook. What's up, YouTube? Robert the Corner Drap here, and I'm back again with another episode of Rob's Random Roms. This is where I set Google's random number generator to the number of NES ROMs that I own, which is 549 now, and then I play that game. As you see in the beginning, we actually have, uh, we were not actually really sponsored by Rogue's Apparel, but the guys there, Chad Howell and all of his crew, great people. I really recommend it. This shirt that I'm wearing is one of his new designs, actually. And as you can tell, just badass, clear print. They they wear really well. I've I've gotten some of their stuff in the past. Uh, known him for a couple of years now. And I ran into him at the Japan Festival in Houston on Sunday. And just... Salt of the Earth, really good guy. Highly recommend you go check out his shop. The links for all of his stuff will be in the description below. So thank you again, Chad. But let's get into our actual job here, <laughs> if we can call it that. And we're going to talk about today's game, Hudson Hawk. Now, this movie, this game was, yet again, based on the movie of the same name. It was a platform uh, game developed by Special Effects for the Amiga, the Atari ST, Commodore 64, the ZX Spectrum, and the NES and Game Boy. But it was uh, released for the previous uh, everything but the Game Boy and the uh, NES by Ocean Software. Ocean does some really good work. And Sony ImageSoft released... Uh, for the Game Boy and NES only in America. Now, this game was actually uh, supposed to have an NES version, but when the film tanked, they just dropped it. So, with that little bit of fun, uh, fun trivia out of the way, let's go on ahead and get into the gameplay. See, you got the TriStar Pictures. I've never seen the movie, by the way. I, I never I never took the time to watch it. Hudson Hawk Level 1. Hawk, your first task is to enter Rutherford's Action House. Avoiding the high security system, make your way to the seventh floor where you will open the uh, where you will find the uh, safe. Open the safe, retrieve Leonardo da Vinci's priceless horse sculpture, the Sforza. Good luck. Oh, shit. I got tossed off the roof. I don't know what that does. I'm messing... I'm getting... The impression that he he doesn't really have that good a a a, a vertical, which sucks because he because I need it. Is he just, like, throwing baseballs or some shit? I need to also get... Okay. That didn't work. And I died? Like, the dog biting my ass killed me? That probably would have killed me, or should have. I was trying to get get him to let go of me by hitting him before he hit me, but... He 
He got like a pathetic vertical. I don't even remember who played him in the movie. The fucking bird kicked me off! This is becoming an exercise in, in frustration. A little late on that one, Hudson. Oh, I got, I got the, I, I hate the dog. I also kind of hate the, uh, the noise it makes. Okay, that's weird. And he's got like a psycho midget running around on a on a on a thing. I wonder if I can hit the security camera. Close shave on that one. Hmm. What am I missing in this in this equation? Like you he passed through it. Hmm. And it won't stay where it was, so that way I can jump over the thing. Like, if I could get up close enough to, uh, do what I wanted to do, i.e. wreck that fucking camera's day. You know what? I think we've done enough today <laughs> on that one. I mean... Again, like I said, I never I never saw the movie. Like I never saw Hudson Hawk. I never never had a need to watch it, but I don't care enough now about the the game to want to continue it. It's boring, it's trite, it's it, it's terrible. But um what I do care about is you guys. Thank you for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe, share all those wonderful things. Hit the bell for notifications. Please check out my my friends, Rogues Apparel. Their links will be in the description. Danielle and Will, will from Peace, Love, and Guns will both have their little doobly-doos at the end in the credits. And I will see you all next time. <laughs>no, I, I, I seriously, I love this. I love this shirt. It's, it's a really good shirt. It's very comfortable. Very tight. Like, like form-fitting for me. Love it. High-quality stuff. So...